Hey guys, it's me, Julie, and I am here with my highly anticipated, well, highly anticipated by me, maybe by some of you, I hope, sterling silver video. These rings are little teasers in the background of what's to come tomorrow and possibly the next day. I'm hoping to get all the sterling shown in two videos, but it might take three. Um, so everything you're going to see in the next few days, next couple days is going to be sterling silver and these beauties will be available soon. We are going to look at some rings too today. I have many more. So let's kind of get into position here. Whoop, I'm sorry. I hope I'm not making anybody seasick. I just wanted to show you that. Let's get into position and start looking. Okay, guys. So, um, I made kind of a big investment with the sterling. I decided, you know, go big or go home. <laughs> so hopefully my investment, that light doesn't look good now. I'm sorry. I'm trying to fix the light because I felt it was a little dark. Okay. We're almost there. Almost there. Okay. So anyway, I decided go big or go home. Hopefully it was the right decision. We'll see what you guys think. Um, I've also decided to um, stop plugging Whatmo. Whatmo. That's my customer's name that I was just talking to. That's hilarious. What not as much because honestly, I really enjoy selling on YouTube and it's kind of where I see myself going and maybe just leftover things get sold over at Whatnot. So I'm going to be doing that. So look at this beauty. This is our first one. Sterling silver with some beautiful, um, I'm gonna get my finger out of there so we'll focus, scroll work, I believe that's coral. That's another thing I should tell you, I am not awesome about gemstones, so it is a little bit of a learning experience for me. Um, and if you know better than I do, tell me in the comments, I am totally open to that. So this ring weighs six, uh, excuse me, 3.86 grams, it's a size seven, and I would do this one for, $16, $16 on this one. If you'd like to buy anything, just tell me the timestamp and a description and send it to me in an email, which will be down in my description of this video. Um, right down here, it's my mama and me at outlook.com. Look at this gorgeous one, guys. Can you see how pretty that is? Maybe we should zoom on the stone. Now I believe this to be a kind of turquoise. Check that out. It's absolutely stunning. It is a larger size ring. Oh, maybe I should have been telling you guys that stuff too. So this one's a larger size ring. Um, the stone area is about an inch. It is, let's see, a size eight, has a weight of 16.6 .6 grams, and it is a kind of turquoise. I'm just not sure which which kind? It is gorgeous. I would do this one for $30. $30 on this one. So you'll notice um, the pricing is kind of going by size of the ring. Look at this stunner. I'm pretty sure this is Smoky Topaz. Again, if I'm wrong and you know better, tell me. I would love to learn. Um, it is stunning. It is like a, a brown color stone. It is so pretty. The facets are gorgeous. It is 3.38 grams and a size six. And I would do this one for $18, $18. Oh, look at this one, guys. I believe this is orange topaz. And it's got like a little cross on the side. It's a higher setting. It's absolutely gorgeous. It is on the smaller side. Um, this one is a size 4.75, and you can see the grams there. Um, maybe even a midi ring. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's kind of cool. Check her out. All right. And I will do this one for, uh, we'll do $19 on this one also. I think that's what I said on the last one. Okay, what have we got next? Okay, we have a band now. It's really pretty. Remember, everything is sterling silver. It's really pretty. There's your weight. It's a size nine and a half. And I would do this one for $12. $12 on that one. Here is something really pretty. Do you see like the little cloudiness and the, what's that called guys? Do you know, it does that have a name that like little cloudiness in it? I think it's so neat. 
Did I have a guess on this? I thought maybe quartz, but I'm not sure. It's really pretty. Um, this one's a size six and three quarters, and I would do this one for $15. $15, has a nice little skinny dainty band. And I have my guys on too. I've got my Labradorite, which I cannot get to flash in these lights. It flashes like crazy. And my Moonstone, and there are more of those to be had. Actually, this exact ring I found, so really pretty. Okay, next. Okay, this guy, he's covered in like little marcasites or faux marcasites, but there is a problem. He's a misfit. There is one missing stone, which I'm not seeing right now as I look. Oh, I'm, maybe I'm wrong. This isn't the one with the missing stone. Oh, I lied, guys. This one has all of its stone. I apologize. There is one that's going to be at some point in some of this um, that does have missing stones. It's a heavy one. It's a size five and a half, and I will do this one for $19, $19. Okay, look at this little dainty baby. It's a little mother of pearl butterfly. So cute. Not very patinaed if you like that. Um, it is a six and three quarter. Maybe for someone with larger fingers, this would also be a cute midi ring. Oh, I like that. Oh, I like that a lot. My problem with all of this jewelry is every time I go through the sterling silver, I find more I want to keep and I have to not do that. <laughs> I will do this one for $12. $12, you guys. It's been very dangerous, so please buy it and get it out of here or I'm in trouble. <gasps> you guys, Moonstone. Like my Moonstone. And she flashes. Can you see her? Whoa, look at that. It's gorgeous. Um, so there's her weight and she's a seven and a quarter and it is moonstone and she's absolutely stunning, 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 stunning. I will do this one for $22. Okay. $22. I'm going to move that out of the way because it seems like it's better without. Okay. We've got some lapis guys for all you lapis lovers. You see the gold in there? Oh, gorgeous. Really, really pretty. Um, has a nice dainty band. There's its weight and it's a six and a half. And I would do the lapis for, let's go $16 on this one. $16. Can you hear me digging in the rings? Doesn't it sound awesome? Oh, guys, look at Mystic Topaz. Check that out. Wow. And it is ringed with um, marcasite or faux marcasite. I'm not totally sure on that. It is absolutely stunning. Could be worn as a men's or a woman's ring. It's a size 11 and a half. There's its weight. It's a chunker. This one will be $35, $35. And remember, these are sterling, so you can get them sized if you'd like to. Look at all those facets. Oh my goodness. Oh baby. <laughs> so so pretty okay this one is missing a stone right there in the middle is that the only one nope there's another one right here I still thought it was a pretty fantastic ring um if people are a little ways away I don't even think they would notice but that's totally up to the person of course up to the wearer um I think it's just the neatest ring it is a size five and a half that's its weight and missing stones was my note on this one. I would do this one just for $12, you guys. Otherwise, it probably would be closer to 30 if it wasn't missing stones. Got another moonstone. Look at her flash. This is a dainty one. Uh, let's see, size seven and a quarter. There's its weight, gorgeous moonstone. Little dainty baby. Oh, wow. I love it so much. I love Moonstone and I love Labradorite. I love the flash. The flash is everything. Okay, sorry. Got sidetracked by the gorge. Um, let's do this one for $16. $16. Okay, this is a neat little ring. It's sterling silver like everything. And it's a little band that kind of is a barrel shape. It bows out in the center a little bit. It's a size 5. There's its grams. It's a heavier guy. I actually tried it on as a midi ring last night, and I thought, that's pretty cool with the right kind of jewelry, the right kind of outfit. It, it definitely makes a statement. 
Um, I, let's see, I would do this one for, I would do 16 on this one, 16. It's a little heavier. Okay, guys, I believe this is coral. So here's where I get, get, gets messed up. Excuse me, I couldn't get my words there. Red Jasper and coral. I have a hard time with it. <laughs> I think, now that I'm looking through the light, I'm wondering if this is Red Jasper. It's a nice little dainty beauty. Um, size five and a half, there's its weight. And I would do this one for 14, $14. And I didn't clean anything because I know people like the patina. This one's very similar. Again, I think it's coral, possibly red jasper. I apologize. I have been honestly crunching like I'm taking a final exam trying to learn my stones. Um, it's a size six, that's its weight. It's really pretty. I would do this one for 14 also. Check this one out. I wasn't sure. See, it has that cloudiness again, which is really cool. And I put smoky something. Um, I'm not sure. Smoky quartz, possibly. I think smoky tor topaz is um, that brown color I showed you. So I'm not sure. Very, very pretty. Size nine and a half. There's its weight, and I would do this one for $16, $16. Here we go. I'm pretty sure this is obsidian. Really pretty ring. And uh, if we look, oh, I was gonna see if you could see underneath. Sometimes the underneath gives you a hint. Size seven, um, gorgeous, beautiful ring. Gorge. Let's do 16 on that one. $16. Okay, here's another one. I think this one is core. No, I said red jasper on this, so I think it probably is. I just am not sure. Look at the cool wrapping they did with the sterling. It's so, so neat. This one is a size four and a half. So it's a little guy. A little pinky ring for some, a midi ring for others. I would do this one for $16. Okay, here's another one. I thought initially this was coral, so I'll go with that, but as I've said, I'm not positive. Look at how pretty. This one's a little longer than the ones I've been showing you. This one is a size six and a quarter. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh, um, $16, sorry guys, I forgot a price. All right guys, I don't know what this is. I was tempted to say it's not even a stone, that it's clay, but then it kind of taps like a stone. I'm tapping another stone. So I'm not sure. I'm not sure what this is. I basically have no clue. <laughs> so um, here's the, pri um, the grams, and it's a size six and a half, and I will do this one for $12, $12. I'd, I don't know, guys. I don't know what that is. It stumped me. Look at this cool band, you guys. I wish this fit me. I think it's so cool. I love the patina. Oh, my gosh. Size 7. I would do this one for $19. $19. Okay. Blue opal. Look at that fire. Wow. Okay. Uh, size six. And there's your grams. Absolutely stunning. Love this ring. I would do this one for 19. 19 on that one. Okay. Let's see what this guy is. Uh, garnet. It's hard to see, but it is red. Oh, there you go. It's, it's a garnet. Look at it. It's so pretty. Hello, garnet baby. Um, let's see, it's a size six and three quarter. My mother-in-law got me a garnet ring. Let me, um, so this one I'll do for 16. Got me a garnet ring one year for Christmas. And, um, I thought it was so cool because she did it because my husband's birthday is in January. Um, I'm wondering, so anyway, I thought it was just a cool idea to wear my husband's stone. So anyway, um, this is a size five and a half six grams and it is a rough cut stone so it's not polished i don't totally know what it is but i'm wondering if it could be labradorite um you can see that it does have some flash in there or maybe this is what moonstone looks like before it's polished really neat ring though 
I think it's cool to see the rough side of things. This is six, uh, $16. Okay, guys, I don't know what stone this is besides being fantastical. Look at it. It's so pretty. It's like pinks and peaches and mauves and a little bit of like a charcoal color. It's stunning. This ring is stunning. Um, size six and a quarter. And I would do this one for $19. $19. I hope you're not getting sick of rings. I could look at rings all day. I know many of you have told me that rings are your favorite. So this is a kind of topaz. A topaz. <laughs> not right. Turquoise. It's a kind of turquoise. Um, it is a seven and a quarter. Really beautiful. Check that out. So pretty. I would do this one for $17. Look at this. This fascinated me. Do you see like the ridge? I think you can see it. I believe this is obsidian. Has an incredible little ridge in it. Um, it's a size seven and three quarter. It is stunning. I would do this one for $19. $19. Okay, Labradorite guys. Look at, can I get her to flash? She flashes, I'm telling you. So, so pretty. Um, size seven and three quarter, and I would do this one for 19. It's absolutely stunning. <laughs> I love Labradorite. Here's a little baby, a little baby amethyst. Look how cute it is. Um, it is a size six, and I would do this one for you guys for uh, 14. $14. I always start getting nervous that my pricing doesn't make sense a little ways in, like I've been changing things. Guys, is this a moss agate? I feel like it might be. Not positive on that. Or a moss, oh, I called it moss jasper, but I think it's moss agate. Size seven and a half. Really beautiful in a really pretty setting. I would do this one for $16. 16 Okay, I don't know what this is either. It's a size six and a half. It is brown in color and it has a rough spot right here. Um, kind of like a breakage, but I've noticed that if they polish down and then there's like a crack below it, you might get one of these interesting little, little areas where the stone's a little rougher. Um, let's look at it under the magnifying glass just to make sure that it isn't like a full on damage. Now, see, it's just kind of part of it. I think it's cool. I don't know what this stone is. Um, I would do this one for $14, $14. If anybody knows what that stone is, I'd love to know. I have another band for you. It has kind of like a flat spot there and then some engraving or etching. Uh, size nine and a half, and I would do this one for fourteen, fourteen dollars. Okay, another band. This one's a five and a half. Really cute. Um, I would do this one for twelve dollars, twelve dollars. Okay, we have another kind of turquoise, I believe. I'm not positive on that. It's a little bit. Let me look out of the light for a second, guys. I want to show it to you. Actually, I'm not sure if this is turquoise. Do you see it? It's really cool. Um, so this one is a size seven and a quarter. I would do this one for $16. $16. Okay, here's another brown stone um, with an amazing, like, flashy line through it. It is so cool. Let's look up close because I was like, what the heck is this thing? Look at it. It's got like a flash line in it. I'm going to look out of the light. It's so cool. Anyway, um, I'm not sure what this is. It's a size six and three quarter. Um, and I would do it for 16 $16. Okay, guys, the jury's out on this. I really thought there might have been a stone right there at some point, right? Doesn't it seem like that? And then I thought, well, maybe it's just abstract because it could totally just be that, right? Tell me what you guys think. I'm going, I'm going to sell it as it's just abstract and not missing a stone. Um, 
I, I don't know, honestly. It's a seven and a quarter, really cool lines. I would do this one for 14. Okay, we got one, a band with little wave symbols little wave pictures size 10 I would do this one for 14 14 dollars is that a color let me see if I can get you a color it's kind of a charcoal -y color guys maybe with a hint of blue in it okay next okay I think this is an amethyst it has like cloudy things in it which I think is okay I think it's an amethyst um, it's a size 8 there's this weight, and I would do this one for $16, $16. Okay, I believe this guy is an orange topaz also. Has a really pretty setting with some, I gotta look out of the light for a second. Yeah, these are like vermeil kind of little bars on it there. I love this ring, love. Size eight, <gasps> really? Oh geez, all right. If nobody buys it, it might go in my jewelry box. <laughs> I'm going to do this one. I don't remember why I did the other orange topaz, and it was similar, but I'm going to do this one for $19, okay? $19. Um, okay, what have we got here? Not sure what this is, guys. It has, um, it's a greenish stone. Um, I guess it could be like an emerald, I don't know. An emerald maybe I really don't know and I don't have a gem tester which might mean that you guys get some incredible bargains or I don't know <laughs> it's a size nine and three quarter and I'll sell this one for 16 it's really pretty solitaire setting okay not sure about this guy um so look at that I never saw that it had flash look at so now I'm thinking moonstone do you see the flash I didn't see that when I was looking at it downstairs. Oh yeah, that's Moonstone. I wasn't sure because it was so like cloudy, cloudy on top. That's really pretty. Um, it's a seven and a half. There's its weight in case you're interested in that. Um, there's a the raw Moonstone, that's cool. Uh, and this one will be, how much is this one? This will be 16, $16. Okay, I believe this is also amethyst. It is amazing. It's a little bit bigger of a stone. It's a size eight. Stunning. That can also fit me. Stunningly dangerous for me. <laughs> Please, somebody buy her so I don't keep it. I just had to get ring displays, more ring displays for my jewelry cabinet because I am on a definite ring kick. Okay, anyway, sorry, um, 19 on this one, guys, 19. Okay, check this out. I think this is so cool. Look, it's a hunk of silver that looks like it's twisted, almost like a branch. I mean, I think this thing is so neat, you guys. Remember, everything's sterling, you guys. Um, and if you're interested in buying anything, my uh, email's in the description, my mama and me at outlook.com. Um, and just give me a timestamp and a description or a screenshot, either one. The most important thing is a timestamp. Um, so this is a seven and a half and it's a pretty good weight on it. Yeah, it's a pretty good weight. Let's sell this one for 19, okay? $19. A little red jasper. I think that's red jasper. Tell me if you think it's something else. And it has these little teeny little scrolls. Let's look with the thing because I feel like, yeah, look at it. It's cute. Okay, it's a size 3.75, three and three quarter. It is a little guy. Gorgeous. Oh my goodness, it's gorgeous. We'll do this one for 14, guys. $14. Okay. This is another one that it's like they polished and then they got to a spot that was lower and I don't know, I just find it interesting. And look, it looks like that brown stone again with the flash, do you guys see it? Maybe it's Labradorite, maybe I'm not realizing that there are spots in Labradorite that are brown. So it does have this like um, raw unpolished center here, okay guys? excuse me taking a breath <laughs> it's a size six um i would do this one for 16 16 
Check this one out. I really love this ring. And look, somebody was selling it for $50. Cubic zirconia, um, gold plate, and sterling silver. Look at it. So pretty. It's a nine and a half. Um, and I will do this one. I'm going to do this one for $25. Okay, $25. Uh, okay, what have we got? Lapis has the little goldy flecks in there. Look at that pretty setting. It's wrapped. Really cool. Size six. Size six. I will do this one for 16. Um, okay. I think this is rose quartz. I think I am correct. <laughs> um, it's a size eight and a half. And there's its weight for you. I'm not saying the weight anymore, guys. It's really cool looking. I will do this one for 19. Okay, not sure what this is, but guessing maybe Larimar? What do you guys think? I'll give you an up close on it. It's a guess of mine. Okay, it is a size seven and a quarter and it is stunning. And I would do this one for $19. $19. Okay, we've got another band. It's a pretty band with a rope detail. It's a size eight and a half. And I would do this one for $14. $14. We have an old choir ring. Isn't this cool? I didn't realize people collect things like this, but they do. So this is somebody's choir ring, like a school ring from the choir. Um, it is a size five and I would do this one for $14, $14. Okay guys, this one's stunning. Are you ready? Look at that baby. It's so cool. Faux pearl with no issues on it. And it kind of like gives you like an ombre effect between the black and the clear stones. Really pretty. I did not see any missing. This was from a jewelry store at one point and it says crystal, $65, sterling silver, FW, full weight. I, I don't know what that means. So where is the size? Six and three quarter. And I will do this one for $30, $30. And this really should be in a bag, and it's not, because I don't want that pearl to get scratched. So we're going to make sure it's safe over there. Okay, guys, another amethyst. Okay, I should say an amethyst, I think. But look at when the light hits this one. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I love it. It's a seven and a half, and I would do this one for $19. $19. Okay, I believe this one to be coral. Is that what I guessed last night? Yep, could be red jasper. I apologize. I'm not sure. It's an amazing setting. The shape of it makes me think coral, right? That's what does it for me. Um, it's an eight and three quarter, and I would do this one for 16 $16. We're getting down to the end of this bag, and we'll switch out of rings for a little bit. This is malachite, and it is stunning. Look at it. It does dip a little, but you know, it's a natural product. It's a stone. Um, it's a seven and three quarter. And I would do this one for 19. It's awesome. Awesome, awesome. Okay, let's see what else we got. Okay, this one is missing a stone. This is probably what I was thinking of. Do you see it right there? And I think there might be one more. I don't see it. I don't think it hinders it totally. Like if you know what I mean? Like if you're kissing close, then they might see. If you're friendship close, definitely if you're socially distancing, you're good. <laughs> um, it's a five and a half. And I would do this one for $14. $14. Okay, so this one, check this one out, guys. So it is like a verme wash or a gold tone over some of the sterling here. It has a really high profile. Look at that. Woo. Um, and it has room for some finger fat. So you might be able to get a little bit 
of a bigger finger than the actual size. <laughs> uh, it's a four and a half, okay? Four and a half, and I will do this one for $12. $12 on that one. Okay, we're in the last two in this bag, and then I have one in a bag by itself. Okay, let's see. Um, moonstone, little dainty moonstone, baby. Look at it flash. So pretty, so pretty. Um, size seven, I'll do this one for 16. Actually, I'll do this one for 14 for you guys, 14. This ring says love, faith, love, faith, and hope. Really pretty. It's a size six and a quarter, and I would do this one for $14. And then I have one little guy in a bag over here. This was not bought in the lot, the grouping of rings I bought. I've had this one in my little sterling bucket. It's kind of cool. It's, it's really dainty. It is just a ring of sterling with a little twist in it. Can I get on this finger? So it's really cool. Isn't that neat? I really like this. Um, it is a size five and three quarter. Five and three quarter. And I will do this one for um, $10. $10 on that. I don't know the weight. Sorry, guys. I had this for a while and I did not weigh it. Okay, let's switch to some other things. Um, it is bagged and I am going to be going through it with you guys for the first time in. Oh, I just found a bag, guys. Let's bag that stunner because I don't want anything to happen to her. I feel like the pearl could get damaged. You want another look at her? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And remember, it's sterling, so you can actually have some things sized. It's not just costume. Not that it's just costume, because most of my rings are just costume. <laughs> okay, so pair of earrings for you guys. Sterling silver. Cute little hoopers. Let's see how big these guys are. About a half an inch. So cute. I would do these for $10. $10. Nice pair of earrings, you guys. Okay, let's see what's next. You guys want to see the bag? Okay, so I thought I could get 20 for this on eBay. It is an amazing bracelet. It is sterling. Is that oh, a designer? I don't know. I don't know anything about that. Okay, it's really cool. It kind of seems like it might have had a gold wash over it. But it's faded very um, evenly, so like it's fine. Like it, it looks like it's supposed to be that way. If there was, um, it's like a six and a half. It's honestly between a six and a half and a six and three quarter. Okay, come on, go in the right spot. Can you guys see? It kind of has a little bit of a gold tone to it. Really cool. Okay, I would do this one for fifteen for you guys. Fifteen dollars. Next, next, ooh wee, I really like this. Oh wow, I like this. Look at that, you guys. Can you see it? Sterling silver hinged bangle with a safety chain. Let's get a size on it. I would say six and three quarter, guys. Stunning. I would do this for 25, 25. Okay, oh, another cool pair of earrings. I like these, I like them. Okay, look at them. Oh, wow, I really like these. <laughs> Sterling cuteness. I'm gonna ask 15 for these. I think they're probably worth it, $15. Okay. Oh my gosh, you guys, I love these. These are made by um, Farfetched. They do some really cute things. Um, hold on, I'm having a, it doesn't want to go back the way it's supposed to. And it's a teacup and, um, uh-oh. It's a teapot and a teacup. And hold on, he just came off his little wire. No big deal, but I gotta make sure I put them on the right way. Yes, this way. Through the camera. Oh boy. Will she be able to do it? Yes. 
I hope you're betting on me. <laughs> okay, let's see. We've got, oh no, it's the wrong way. I promise I will fix it. A teapot and a teacup from Farfetch'd. So, so cute. I will do these for $12. $12. My mom used to collect teapots. She does not anymore. But those would have been cute for her if she did. So, so cute. Okay, so I have a pair of these guys. They're sterling. I have no clue what that is. It's dirty, definitely. Maybe a smoky, uh, maybe an orange topaz. I'm not sure. Is that broken? Uh-oh, hold on, guys. Hold on. Let's look with our little handy-dandy tool. Looks like it might have a little chip. It just feels rough. That's how I notice, not with my eyes. Okay, so I had thought I could get $10 for these on eBay two years ago again. Remember, my pricing was done two years ago on most of this. And I would sell them to you guys for $7. Seven. $7. Sterling, oop, another pair of earrings. These are cute. That's the nine two five side. <laughs> I'm having a hard time staying, having it stay the right way. There you go. And they are, oh my goodness, sorry. They are lever backs. I would do these for ten. Ten dollars for you guys, and those are like a a red color uh, acrylic stone. Okay. I forgot to put my phone on Do Not Disturb. So every time you hear a little bit of a weird pause, it's because I'm reading a text, which I should not be doing. These are really cool, guys. I think these are called potato pearls, but I'm not sure. They are a real pearl. Um, they are not perfect because pearls are not perfect when they are this kind of pearl. It is a sterling silver hook. They are a gray color. And they're fantastic. I love these. And I have a second pair that are a uh, creamy color. So I will do these for $10. They're really nice. And I'll show you the creamy pair right now. I just happened to grab them at the same time, which worked out great. Again, I don't know if it is a potato pearl. It's called something like that. They're supposed to not be perfect. It's one of the ways, not this kind of pearl, but it's also one of the ways you tell there's the marking. Um, if pearls are real when they're not all exactly perfect in a string, you know. I think these are neat that they're so like abstract. Abstract. Okay, $10 on those. Really cool. Um, anybody know what this stone is? This is kind of a weird situation. Not really. I mean, somebody might be interested. It's almost like it's a red malachite, but I don't know what that is. This is a single earring, guys, and I'm gonna sell this as a single and hope that somebody, does that say made in Mexico? Let's see. Um, I'm not sure. <laughs> Hold on, let me use my loop, guys. I would love to know what this stone is. If somebody would let me know, I would be very appreciative. It does, it says ATI925 Mexico. I was thinking that somebody might be able to make a pendant out of this. So I thought it'd be fun to sell it to somebody who might be able to do something with it. Or you guys, I have been hearing that the mismatch earrings thing was a thing and I didn't realize. And then I started looking around. It's crazy. It's everywhere. And they're awesome. They're awesome. So if somebody had another one that was a little more dangly with a stone like this, wearing them together is cool right now. And it is cool looking. <laughs> All right, so I'll do this single earring for $7. Hopefully somebody can do something cool with it. I don't have abilities with silver, unfortunately. And I'm getting a delivery, so the puppers are barking. They're doing their job down there. I'll feed them today. Just kidding. <laughs> they eat better than we do. Sterling silver or 14 karat gold filled ear wire. Okay. $11.99 originally, a very pretty Jody Coyote. And I will do those, new on the card, by the way, that's a good thing, uh, for Christmas. I'll do those for eight, eight dollars. Okay, I thought I could get 25 for these and I believe it's because they are actually gold. Um, I just wanna look, I don't have it written down. Do I, is it on here anywhere? Okay, let's do this, let's hold on these and I will, Oh, they are. Duh. Look at guys. 
10 carat, Julie. <laughs> I thought I had it written down. So we have a little gold intruder in our sterling show, but that's okay. It's precious metal, right? That's what we're working on. 10 karat gold earrings, gorgeous. Did you guys watch my video where we found uh, 14 karat gold bracelets that I thought were not gold and they totally were? Um, I will do these for $20, $20. Okay, another pair of earrings and then I'll see if I can get some uh, necklaces because we've done rings, we've done earrings, we've had a couple bracelets. We haven't seen any necklaces. Let's see what this is. These are cute, all little crosses with a little um, faux, like pinky color pearl. Really pretty. Let's do, um, let's do $8 on these for you. $8, remember they're sterling. Um, okay, I'm gonna try to grab some chains. Here, I'll put them in front of you so you can see. Okay, those are all bracelets. <laughs> chains, guys, trying for chains. Chains, necklaces, anybody, please? <laughs> Oh, okay, so this one here was interesting. This is heavy, you guys. <laughs> um, and it is sterling. And I know the beads are sterling for sure. Uh, I have tested it. And it has a toggle clasp. It looks like somebody might have made it. I do not remember if all these are sterling, but look, it's a twofer. You could wear it this way, or you could wear it this way with all the words showing. Isn't it cool? Um, I want to quickly, if you guys would be okay with it and bear with me, I want to quickly just check the charms and why don't we just scratch a ball too, just to make sure. Um, just to make sure. Okay. So we've got ball charm. Let's see. Let's see. What do I've got? 18 carat. Okay. We've got what we need. And whoops, both sterling guys, both sterling. Look at them, look at the blue. It's such a pretty color when it glows up, isn't it? So my dog, my puppy sneaked in here the other day and I don't know if you remember from my video, I was like, I better clean this trash cause I've got all this testing stuff. She went right to it. I'm like, get out of there. So I did a big clean in my room, but now I just added to it again. Ten inch drop, incredible. I will do this for thirty dollars. Thirty dollars. How much time we've got? Like three minutes? Okay, I'll show a couple more things. Sterling silver. Can you hear my belly growling? I hope not. <laughs> okay, sterling silver, guys. Check that out. Probably onyx or something in the cross. It's really cool. Sterling silver chain. Let's get you a length. It is a 10 inch drop and the cross is approximately an inch or so with the bail. Really cute. I will do this one for $20, $20. Um, why don't we look at this one? Ooh, I thought I would get a lot of money for this one online. It must be something I looked up. It must've been good. It is a charm bracelet, you guys. Um, I'm going to go off camera for one minute and see if I can make it look a little nicer. Because it is all. Okay, so it has bells. And it has kids. It looks like two girls and a boy, maybe. Um, it has this kind of press latch clasp thing or majigger. Can I do it through the camera? Probably not. <laughs> Hold on guys, I gotta do it out of the camera because my brain has a hard time working through the camera. Okay, I'm having a hard time. There we go, got it. And it has a long um, safety that's actually on with a clasp. Somebody probably added that. It is 925. I'm questioning, I'm questioning if the bells are 925 also. Ugh, guys, I just have such a hard time through the camera. This really isn't hard. I'm just struggling. There we go. Um, questioning if the bells are also 925. I feel like we should check it so you know what you're looking at. And I thought 
that this little charm bracelet could get me $55 on eBay. $55 on eBay. Wow. All right. So let's check this. I dragged my thing through it. I didn't mean to do that. It is. Okay. So it's all sterling, guys. Let's do this for $35. $35 all sterling charm bracelet. And I think I'm going to stop there. So what I think I'll do is lift you guys up so you can look at the eye candy up here while I talk to you for two seconds. If there's anything you want to purchase, just remember my um, email address is in the description, my mama and me at outlook.com. And I, uh, what was I going to say? I'm not sure. I got sidetracked by this because I have no clue what kind of stone this is. Maybe I'll show you now and just say, help, tell me what it is. I heard there's a purple turquoise. I didn't know that. Maybe that. I, I don't know. It's a lovely purple color. Anyway, so I will be back tomorrow with some more sterling. Um, looking at what we have left, I don't think we can do it in two videos. I think it's going to be three. So please enjoy them. Please like, comment, subscribe. I appreciate you so, so much. You have no idea. And I love, love, love reading your comments. I probably am slightly addicted to checking for new comments. It's probably not a great thing, but I love it. <laughs> I appreciate you being here. Um, you guys, tell me what your favorite piece was today and what your favorite stone is, semi-precious. And maybe even like um, our, a precious stone, like diamonds and things like that. Tell me what your favorite stones are. Pick a couple. It's up to you. It's your prerogative. <laughs> Remember, you can be anything you want in this world, so please choose to be nice. Thank you, guys. Bye-bye.